Okay, here we are in Princeton. We just showed up at the, uh, the Princeton Municipal Campground. I'll show you around the campground. It's beautiful, it's right on the river. There's also a highway going by, so this is just a stop for us for the night before we head into Colmont and Granite Creek. But this is a nice little stopover to visit family. Cost us $36 a night, but it has full hookups, water, power, and they were even able to provide some firewood for us. I'm just going to walk you a little bit through the park right now so you can see what the park looks like. Seems like there's plenty of room for people to park all alongside the river, so everybody has a little bit of river access. This is the main road back to the office. Friendly little guy that uh, runs the office here, he actually lives in one of the uh, trailers here, which is awesome. So he's on site. Very peaceful, quiet place. Except for the uh, highway traffic. It's pretty awesome for our first night. So I'm just going to pan over, show you that that's where the highway is. So this is about three kilometers outside of Princeton. It's actually right beside the Princeton Golf Course, which is on the right side, heading east. This is on the left side. And there's beautiful mountains behind there. And the river running right behind us. So I'm going to give you a shot of the river. is behind all the campsites here. Beautiful little river. I believe this is the Tulamine. And along this river you get a lot of fish. So, well, it gives you that peaceful sound at night when you're trying to sleep. I like it. The wife doesn't. But I like it. All right, just walking through our campground now. It's nice and peaceful on this end. There's really nobody here tonight. It's a Monday and we're on September the 29th. So beautiful weather. There's our RV that we rented from Fraser Way RV. Those guys are great. This is our second time renting from them. Last time we got a camper slide out which we loved it was great because we were going off woods but the problem was is it didn't have a generator and the wife likes to plug in her electronic equipment at night and if you do not have power hookups you don't have a generator so this one comes with a generator not needed tonight because we have hookups but we'll be using it tomorrow we'll be checking in with you again tomorrow night when we get to Colmont and Granite Creek.